Continuing on with the Omokara. Okay, so we're looking at all the different things that can, that can happen when you're actually going to put an Omokara on someone. Okay, so we're just doing the setup that we've been doing this last few weeks from a close guard. Uh, open guard, okay, feet on hips guard. Okay, from here, through, foot. Yeah, push on the shoulder. <laughs> Kick my leg through. Straight to my own car. But sometimes what happens is, before I can actually make my triangle, I drive a shoulder to the mat, okay, your opponent can latch onto your leg. Okay? And maybe step over it with his knee. So we're going to show you it's called the omoplata to the omoplata. Okay, so basically I'm going to do an omoplata with one leg rather than using the triangle. So again, from here, okay, rather than just abandoning, abandoning my omoplata once he latches on for the leg, okay, I want to make sure my foot goes across his face and I'm going to drive my shin into his face. Okay, and I'm going to come up on my left elbow, I'm going to push this heavy into my hip, okay, and all I'm going to do is get, put my knees to the mat and, dr and force car to roll. Car, make sure you keep my leg in your half guard. Yep. Okay. I'm going to bring my knees to the mat, force him to roll, and I'm going to keep my grip. So I end up here. Okay. So I'm going to stuff this, put my hand to the mat, okay. I'm going to grip my thigh, and I've still got the mono plata. All I'm going to do is pull up on my knee, so I move my butt this way. Okay. And As I bring my leg over his face, Carl's latching on the leg, so I can actually do my omoplata, which I want to do. And he's got it, he's, he's driven my leg between his legs, so rather than abandoning okay, the omoplata, I'm going to switch to the monoplata, which, just is, which is an omoplata with one leg. So from here, I let go of the lapel, and I come up, transition up onto my elbow, I'm going to keep this stuffed in my hip. Now I'm going to bring both my knees to the mat, and force Carl to roll over his shoulder. Here, it's really important that I keep this shin across his face because the car sits up into me I'm going to drive this into his face the shin that's detail one detail two is I got to post my hand on the mat okay because if I sit all the way back at my elbow car can straighten his arm and pull it out okay so I want to make sure I'm posted right up on my right hand driving with my shin across his face grab the outside of the knee okay and then all I do is move my hips to the outside Okay, this is not an arm bar, okay, because the arm is still bent, so it's still an umoplata, but I'm finishing it with one leg. Okay, let's do that one more time. So again, from close guard, sleep control, hip escape, feet on hips guard, okay, I'm going to kick my leg through, put on my shoulder, so it's my grip. The lapel, so shoulder guard, same setup okay, that we've been using. Okay, push on the shoulder, pull on the lapel, kick my leg through. But as I shoot for the omoplata card, drops my leg here. Okay. So rather than abandoning, first thing I do is I let go of the collar with my left hand, come up on my elbow. Okay, stuff this into my hip, and all I'm going to do is put my knees on the mat, force car, roll over your shoulder. Then I'm going to post with my hand on the mat, keep my grip, driving with my thigh in the space on my shin. And then I'm going to pull my knee up as I hip escape to the outside. Okay, so that's the omoplata to the omoplata. Let's do a lot, guys. Okay.